Hey all, thanks for stopping by and a big shout out to all my new friends down in Arizona where they're cooking. I feel like you're under a magnifying glass down there. Anyway, finally made it back home and I want to say something to you folks down there. You let Monsanto come into your neighborhood and they're going to promise you a bunch of empty promises just like they promised these farmers here way back in the day. And now this corn that's growing right here you know, they promised, you know, we wouldn't have to use as much pesticides or sprays to kill the weeds, and we're using way more than they used to. They can't kill the weeds. The weeds have become resistant to the sprays, and they just keep pouring more and more on. There's nobody checking the safety standards of any of this, what they're mixing. I mean, this is one of my dogs that's suffering from the sprays, which your dogs are going to suffer from. The other one's dead. You know, they don't, they don't care. It's all about money, money, money. Having the newest, biggest equipment, money, money. And Monsanto just cares about money, money. You know, so they're going to destroy your water table. They're going to destroy the land that you have around you. And they're going to kill you all. It's just a... It's what they've been doing since we brought this stuff back from World War II. Do the history, you know. This is my place, you know. I got all these organic signs, do not drift. It should say, quit killing kids with cancer spray. Grow something that is worth eating. But no, everything must die for the sake of, you know, these chemical companies. See this tree here? It, it ha its choice is to die so somebody can be rich. I mean, look at these trees. I'm gonna drive back in here. This place used to be covered in trees. This whole play, every, every farm had trees, shade trees. But they're sacrificing the shade trees so they can spray more chemical. I mean, look at these trees. They're just dying everywhere. This little group of trees tries to come up every year. I mean, I've been watching this for years, and it's not just my place, it's everywhere. And all my mulberry trees are over there, and they're all getting sprayed. You can't, you can't eat the stuff, it's what about killed me. So anyway, I'm gonna end this video. The garden had an irrigation issue. I am gonna do a video soon on, uh, you know, we're, I'm giving it water again. We're gonna see what, what, uh, survives from it but anyway so watch for that video I just wanted to do a quick video on some of the new people I met down down in Arizona that are concerned about the new plant that that's came in down there and it's really sad because they never fulfill their promises and I know they've changed their name they're you know it's the same old game they've been doing since 1946 you know since we brought all this garbage back from World War II thinking, oh yeah, this technology is gonna help us, you know? Well, this is what it's doing to us. It's, it's destroying everything, killing everything. And it's sick, it's just sick. Anyway, that's it for this video. We'll see you on the next one. And uh, like I say, thank you to all the, the help I had down there. I'm gonna have to unfortunately go down again finish cleaning the house out but um, you know all I can say is eat clean quit believing Monsanto's lies you know little kids dying of cancer is not cool you know I don't care how much money you're making people it's time to start growing food and eating food the way God attended not what big corporate greed cares about you know anyway babbling on see you on the next one thanks for stopping by